As part of National Water Safety Month, the YMCA of Central Kentucky is encouraging parents and caregivers to play an active role in promoting water safety with a water watcher challenge, and it's happened in this May. That's right. The Y introduced the country to group swim lessons uh, over 110 years mm -hmm. ago. It's incredible. Back in 1909, as part of the largest community-based organizations in the country, they teach more than a million children, including those at risk of mm -hmm. drowning, invaluable water safety, and swimming skills each year. Corey Donahue is with us. Corey, thank you so much for being here today, first of all. It is it is a steep tradition that the Y, I mean, I learned to swim at a Y. I, think, I did too. Did you? I yes. thought your brothers threw you into like a flooded quarry or well, something. Well, it sounds that's like what my brothers would do, but that's not what actually happened. The, the, y, the Y's been there for us, and, yes. and we appreciate that. We're, we've got a family membership. We love it. Sure. Um, so tell us a little bit about some of the programs you guys are offering right now. Yeah, so swim lessons are, like you said, one of our staples, uh, and so many people, that's their start with the YMCA, yeah. mm -hmm. whether it's here in Lexington or elsewhere, and we believe that swim lessons and water safety are incredible, invaluable skills for every individual to have. No question. Yeah, absolutely. Why is it so important to start young with your children? I mean, you can learn as an adult, but it is important to get started as early and as young as possible, right? Yeah, absolutely. The, the numbers are scary that, that water safety and, and accidental drownings uh, are high risk of probabilities for younger kids, mm -hmm. especially those between one and four years old. It's the number one leading cause of death in any, anyone one to four years old, oh which is scary. So getting that um, understanding of what water is and, and making sure that individuals that are that young are safe around water are incredibly important. Yeah, I, and I love that you all remind us of this before a big holiday weekend where a lot of folks are out on the water sure. too, because if you haven't had the kiddos to the Y yet for this, make sure that those uh, life jackets are strapped up super tight. They need to be anyway for 12 and under. Yes, absolutely. Uh, but uh, a good reminder though, that if you haven't done this and you're out on the water, mm -hmm. next stop on, on Tuesday following and the weekend needs to be at the YMCA. For sure. Yeah. yeah. So tell us a little bit more about your aquatic uh, programs that you offer at the Y. Yeah, so so we do start with the water safety uh, introduction, making sure that kids understand how that they can um, feel comfortable in the water, but also escape water safely um, if they need to or if they accidentally fall into water, mm. that, that they can learn to float, they can get to the edge, or yes. understand also how to help others um, in the case of a friend or a family member falling into water mm -hmm. and needing um, some support as well. So that's where we start, and then we progress from there on, on more advanced water skills, whether that is um, swim strokes and, and mechanics around that as well. Yeah, for sure. yeah. Because sure. it, sometimes it's, I mean, it is dangerous sometimes to go in after someone who is incapable of swimming and they're going under because it could actually risk your life as well going in so you teach skills to be able to prevent yourself from getting into a situation that you can't get out of in the water as well. Absolutely, yeah. Our, our saying is throw, don't go. We want to nice. try yeah. to reach or throw to somebody that's in the water instead mm -hmm. of going in after them. Well, 110 years going strong. Uh, what is, what's the best way for people to learn more about the programs you offer and to reach out to you all and just get this thing started? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so there's four locations here in Lexington, one in Frankfurt. Uh, we would love to connect with them in person if they want to stop by, or they can visit our website, ymcacky.org, and learn all about all of our programs outside of water wow. um, programs as well. Awesome. Well, Corey, thank you so much for all you do, and thank you for being yeah. here today. Thank Appreciate you. the why, always. Always. Back in just a second, folks. Stick around, please.